She won an Oscar playing Cher's mom in Moonstruck. And now Olympia Dukakis is back on stage in Tennessee Williams' The Milk Train Doesn't Stop Here Anymore. We're at the Laura Pels Theater to get the inside scoop on this story of a wealthy widow and the handsome young stranger who shows up on her doorstep. It is about a tour de force, force of nature woman, writing her memoirs of this fabulous life that she lived. Um, and she's on the Amalfi Coast. And uh, it is about a very significant point in her uh, tumultuous, fabulous um, life. And into her life come various interesting characters. Um, a young man who just appears at her house and she doesn't quite know who he is, she's intrigued by him, so she summons her friend, that'll be me, who is this hedonistic character who lives off this hermetically sealed little island that she's on, and lives in Capri. And it's uh, very much a story of a, a woman not only telling the story of her life, but certainly um, how she affects other people in the play, and how they come into her life and affect hers, and the play is infused with Tennessee Williams's gorgeous poetry. and. It's fantastic. What is it you love about Flora Goforth? Well, I love her journey every night. Her name is Goforth. So she has, she always chooses to go forth to something, which to me is a kind of a spirit that uh, we have, the way we look at life, the way we approach life. And uh, she's a tough old bird. But what you discover during the course of the evening is how really fragile and vulnerable she is. We have to ask about your phenomenal leading lady, Olympia Dukakis. Tell me about working with her. Uh, we have a great time up there, and our relationship in the play is very uh, charged and contentious, and sometimes I'm sort of the straight man to her wild woman, and that's hugely fun. She's a legend, and she's incredible to work with because she's, uh, you know, um, such a powerhouse and when that energy is coming at you it's uh it can be a little scary at first but then it's fun when you ease up and try to roll with it she's smart she's very hardworking, extremely intelligent and it's what you wish and hope for to work with somebody whom you have a great affinity for the play is about loss but the determination not to be defeated by it this is some new ground for Tennessee, and when he wrote it, it was a it's very personal play, and it, it deals with death, but it's also very funny, and you see Kabuki dancing, and uh, a naked guy from Mad Men, so you can expect all of that. What can an audience member expect to see? A lot. Uh, a lot of me. 